with Chief Meteorologist Jesse Walker. Welcome back, everybody. We've seen some showers and storms off to the west in western Illinois dropping to almost due south and fading away. Some of this getting into the St. Louis area here shortly, but those are staying away from this area, so that is the good news. Here's what we're tracking, kind of the same thing we've been tracking all along. Dry for now. High heat index values are coming up, and we're going to take a look at the 4th of July. Speaking of the heat index, here's what I think it's going to be looking like over the next few days. As we get into Saturday, much like today, probably about 96 is where we peak out. Sunday, flirting with 100. Then Monday and Tuesday, right around, if not slightly above 100. Again, this is the heat index. And all of those days, we can't rule out a thunderstorm pops up here or there. I think the rain chances will get a little better on Wednesday, but the heat index is still at 95. So just slow down, take it easy out there with that heat index near 100. 100 over the next few days. You want to take it a little easy out there. And remember, when we talk about temperatures and heat index, that's forecast for the shade. If you're in the sunshine, it can be 10 to 20 degrees higher than that. 89 are high here today. 68 has been the low for the day. We've not gotten any rain. We've gone four days in a row now with no rain at the station and looking pretty dry for a while yet. So that is some pretty good news. There's your sunrise sunset tomorrow. We're still holding at 14 hours, 56 minutes of daylight. We're kind of stuck right there at that max for now. And the river stage in Terre Haute, that's coming back down also in Terre Haute at 12.9 feet. Currently in Terre Haute, 89. The heat index is 94 and the pressure has been holding steady most of the day at just over 30 inches of mercury. Temperatures are in the upper 80s to near 90. We have a 90 in Danville and Champaign, Illinois. Everybody else close to 90 degrees. On the water vapor satellite, you can see that complex of showers and storms dropping down to the south. There's actually an area of high pressure right in this part of the country, and that's going to kind of protect us, keep us mostly dry as we head through the next two, three, maybe four days. Again, off to the west, you'll see the showers and storms. And by the way, the heat is really building out here across the Plain States. Heat index values over 100 from Nebraska down into Kansas and Oklahoma. Here at home, nothing going on. You can see the showers off to the west of this area, but they are dropping south. A few of those clouds spreading over the area. On the Dorset Automotive Doppler radar, look at this, all clean here. Nothing going on again. So it's been a mostly dry week. Off to the west, you can see the rain out here in western portions of Illinois down towards St. Louis, but again, that's not moving in our direction. So there's the rain off to the west of this area. So the rest of tonight looks good. Tomorrow looks good. Can't rule out an isolated storm pops in the afternoon, but looking pretty good as we get through Saturday. A few clouds may pop here or there. Sunday looks good, and maybe late Sunday we may see another dying system moving in from the north. You'll start to see it right there by Sunday evening. So again, we can't rule out a storm pops up here or there late in the afternoon tomorrow or towards the late afternoon hours on Sunday, but generally much of the weekend looks to be pretty dry. So then Sunday evening, again, we may have a dying off system moving close to the area, but then Monday looks pretty good, and so does Tuesday. We kind of stay with the mostly dry outlook. Watch though, we'll stop this clock for you. Unfortunately, here we are stopping at 10 p. Thursday. That's when a lot of fireworks will be going off, 10 o'clock Eastern. Look at this. We do show some rain chances in here, so we'll keep an eye on that, but scattered rain chances will be here as we get closer to the holiday. So for tonight, then, mostly clear. There'll be some cloud cover early, kind of blowing off from those storms to the west, but then clearing out. 69 for the overnight low with a light south wind. During the day tomorrow, we'll kick off the weekend. Sunshine, hot and humid. Can't rule out an isolated storm, but not real likely. South winds 5 to 10, high of 90, but remember the heat index mid to upper 90s, and temperatures will stay hot. Look at these air temps Climbing into the low 90s as we head for the end of the weekend, first of next week. Heat index flirting with 100. Looks like some scattered showers and storms for Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And right now we're thinking for the holidays somewhere in the mid to upper 80s with some scattered thunderstorms. That's your forecast. Now we'll head over to Grant. Hey, thank you.